Until today, on June 21, 2023, more NATO equipment was abandoned as a result of unsuccessful counterattack by armed forces of Ukraine on Novodonetsk direction. Recently, Russian Ministry of Defense published another trophy image of equipment neutralized by Russian forces. Defeat of NATO Armored Column Half of this equipment was abandoned and destroyed by Russian Army from the 5th Brigade and 40th Artillery Brigade of the Pacific Fleet Marine Corps and the OBTF Cascod, while repelling for Novodonek's assaults on Vremesky Ledge. More than 50 NATO equipment was neutralized in the settlement, another very hot spot at the junction south of Donetsk, the Ministry of Defense reported. In its first appearance on the battlefield, Stryker Armored Fighting Vehicle of American Military Donation immediately got a hit. The calculation of Russian Howitzer 122mm inflicted a fire defeat on Stryker and destroyed. Russian Armed Forces of Marines Pacific Fleet inspect several dozen units of immovable equipment. In the footage, they show an Ukrainian Army tank, T-64BV, and an American Maxpro armored vehicle being destroyed by OBTF Cascade fighter. Another piece of equipment attracting attention, Marines Pacific Fleet captured the wheeled gun armored vehicle, AMX-10RC, used by the 37th Marine Brigade of Armed Forces of Ukraine. Russian Marines examine while criticizing French wheeled tank technology, as an abandoned trophy and user manual included. It was designed for Armored Reconnaissance Regiment more than 40 years ago. The Ukrainian military fled from this stuck wheeled tank, as MBT in their frontal attack trying to advance on Novodonets. The counterattack was unsuccessful by NATO alliance, either weapons or sending their troops, this is the main advantage. Half of this equipment can still be recovered to tow trophies to the repair zone, according to OBTF Cascade officer. 